X Factor runner up Rebecca Ferguson graciously accepts invitation to sing at Donald Trump's inauguration. If she can perform track protesting racism. Former X Factor contestant Rebecca Ferguson has been asked to perform at Donald Trump's inauguration. The reality show runner up, 30, announced on her Twitter page on Monday that she had been approached by the new president to sing at the ceremony in Washington, D.C., scheduled for 20th of January. However, the singer noted she would only go through with the appearance if she was allowed to sing Billie Holiday's Strange Fruit, a track controversial in 1930s America for protesting racism. The Liverpool native, who came second on The X Factor back in 2010, confirmed she had been asked by Trump to perform, despite worldwide superstars Beyonce and Aretha Franklin taking to the stage at the ceremonies for Barack Obama. Addressing the matter on the social media site, she wrote, I've been asked and this is my answer. If you allow me to sing Strange Fruit a song that has huge historical importance, a song that was blacklisted in the United States for being too controversial. A song that speaks to all the disregarded and downtrodden black people in the United States. A song that is a reminder of how love is the only thing that will conquer all the hatred in this world, then I will graciously accept your invitation and see you in Washington. Best Rebecca X The song, performed most famously by jazz legend Billie Holiday, is a somewhat bold choice for the Republican ceremony, as the lyrics protest against the issue of racism. Originally constructed as a poem by Abel Mirapol in 1937, the song discusses the brutal lynchings of African Americans, which were rife in the Deep South at the time of writing. The track opens with the lyrics, Southern trees bear a strange fruit, blood on the leaves and blood at the root, black bodies swinging in the southern breeze, strange fruit hanging from the poplar tree. Representatives of Rebecca declined to comment to mail online. The unexpected request is set to mark a high point in Rebecca's career, no doubt helping to increase her fan base over in the States, after finding UK success in light of her appearance on the seventh series of The X Factor. Placing in second behind Maid Cardle, she was signed to Simon Cowell's record label Sicko Music soon after. She suffered a minor hiccup in 2012 however, when she sacked her management and took them to court after accusing them of overworking her. The mother of two launched a scathing Twitter attack on her handlers, claiming she was subjected to such punishing work conditions that she collapsed. However, after another two top ten albums, Rebecca has most recently seen the release of her fourth studio record Superwoman, which she is currently following up with the successful UK tour. While she embarked on a U.S. tour in 2013, the singer has found far less success with her music over in the United States. However, according to the rap, the president-elect is struggling to find acts to perform at his inauguration, in light of his controversial campaign. The site reports that Trump is now willing to pay the act who agrees to perform, in order to draw in a top musician. A fee has never been made to a musical performer before a presidential welcome.